The world's largest democratic election, with over 300 million women voting, nearly the total US population, has just released its results. After winning in 2014 and 2019, the Bharatiya Janata Party, led by Prime Minister Narendra Modi, looks poised for a third term. This historic win marks the first time a Prime Minister has won three consecutive elections since 1962. However, the BJP will not have a single-party majority this time and will need to rely on its partners in the National Democratic Alliance, or NDA. These partners now have a chance to negotiate for more power in the upcoming government. The opposition Indian National Democratic Inclusive Alliance, or India, led by the Indian National Congress, has also made significant gains. They will stake claim to a resurgent opposition movement at the national level. Although not a resounding victory as it had pitched for, the BJP-led alliance can still claim success. Still, it will need to innovate its messaging and policies to regain lost voters. The Congress-led alliance's resurgence is notable but not decisive. The opposition would need to maintain momentum through state elections and parliamentary sessions over the next five years to strengthen its positions. Despite many surprises, one thing remains consistent. Indian voters have spoken impactfully and effectively. They have endorsed Prime Minister Modi for a historic third term, but have called for leadership with compromise and consensus.